Have you heard of the ancient Keyblade War? Huh? Of course I have. Long ago, Keyblade wielders waged a war over the ownership of light. Yeah, the Master's favorite story. I wonder what they planned on doing with Kingdom Hearts after... making it appear. Who knows? I don't get why anyone would initiate a war. So... You know the Lost Masters. Who? They're the ones who started the Keyblade War. Never heard of them. Where'd you hear about that? Or... They're the ones for whom... The war started. I'm not following you. You can drop the facade. Facade? On that land shall darkness prevail and light expire. A prospective Keyblade Master should know this. If you say so. The gazing eye sees the fate of the world. The future. It's already been written. Really? I'm not so sure about that. Besides, who's to say I can't change it? And maybe light will prevail. <laughs> Pretty confident. But things aren't in your favor. Perhaps, but unlike darkness, there's more light than meets the eye. You might be surprised. Oh, I hope so. In order to defeat Xehanort, there are allies we must gather, acting now to rouse them from their slumber. We have discussed this before, Sora. Mm. Your mark of mastery exam was conducted in the hopes you would acquire the power to wake them. However, the darkness nearly took control of you, and your grasp of your new abilities leaves much to be desired. Oh. Furthermore, <coughs> Xehanort nearly made you his vessel, and in the oh. process stripped you of most of the power you had gained by then. I suspect you have already noticed this, correct? But first, you must regain all the strength you have lost. Perhaps it is foolish to expect a complete recovery, but it is absolutely vital you perfect one power. The power of waking, which you failed to master during your exam. There's someone who lost his strength and found it again. A true hero to whom you ought to pay a visit. Perhaps he can point you in the right direction. Oh? <laughs> Got it! Hmm. You can count on us to take care of Sora. I would have it no other way. I put Sora in your hands. And don't forget, we'll keep an eye on you. Oh, this is gonna be lots of fun. It's not a vacation. <laughs> Let's go. Count on us. How are we supposed to get there now? What? I thought you knew. Looks like all the old highways are closed. Didn't Master Yen Sid say that Sora should trust the guidance his heart gives? Come on, Sora! Let's roll! Um... Hey! Would you get serious? Give me a break. I'm trying. These things take time. <sighs> Well, since we've already been before, why don't you try picturing our friends like we're there? Hmm... Wow! <clears throat> Sorry, I got nothing. What did you expect? May your heart be your guiding key. Huh? 
What's that? Master Yen Sid always said that, right before we went off on any of our real important adventures. Really? Ring a bell? <coughs> Maybe I just imagined it. May my heart be my guiding key. <laughs> Olympus Coliseum, here we come! At long last, the time had come. The planets were edging into perfect alignment. And the plan Hades devised 18 years ago was about to reach fruition. The fates had predicted this very future, the day he would seize control of Olympus and rule over all the cosmos. Hades' previous attempts, using Terra, Cloud, and Orin to advance his plans for conquest, had failed. The hour was not yet right. But now the planets were aligned, and nothing could possibly go wrong. A wave of darkness slants down from their celestial rank. And one by one, Hades freed the Titans from their prison. Some of them, the same monstrosities that Sora and his friends had already fought and vested before. With both the Titans and his longing for vengeance against Zeus reinvigorated, Hades began his attack on Olympus. No fanfare? <sighs> nope. Looks like we missed the Colosseum. Sora, you opened the gate. I was a little off again. Sorry. We'll find him. But we need to go. Yeah, up is the usual direction. Well, never hurts to have your head in the clouds. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> hey, we're leaving. I think we might be going in circles. Hmm. Did I make a turn at the wrong rock? Hey, Hercules! Where are you? Oh! <laughs> 
Oh. All right. I know I dotted my I's, crossed my T's, zeroed the hero. So what gives? Who could possibly be trying to give me a migraine by yodeling that Yutz's name? Really? Hades? <sighs> ah, it's just you. Maybe. It's just us? Even for you, that's cold. Don't forget, I can always turn up the heat! Wait, if Hades is here, then where's her? What is everyone's infatuation with that stone? Ah, uh, you know what, never mind. Never mind, I'm cool, I'm good. Because Wonder Boy will be out of my hair soon enough. So you're up to no good again. Of course he is. You bet! Oh, easy. What is this, Sparta? Kind of on a schedule. Don't have time to toss around the old fire and brimstone. The whole cosmos is basically waiting for me to, you know, conquer it. Poor Hades. He thinks he can actually pull it off this time. Where are my titans? Show me your power! That sent him sailing. <laughs> sailing right to where I left. Ah, no biggie. Nice work, boys. So, back to the whole cosmic coup thing. Uh, really? Are you kidding? Jeez Louise. Seriously. When it rains, it pours. Okay, who's the new pest? Hey now, that ain't no way to say hello, especially to your old friends. Ah, oh, perfect. Now I gotta put up with you two. Funny, I don't remember you doing me any memorable favors. So, you can keep your heartless this time. I'm going back to my original plan, all right? So, toodaloo, <laughs> exits that away. Hey, it was great seeing you. Happy trails! We are not here for you. I have my own business to attend to. All I need to know is if there is a distinctive black box somewhere in this world. Black box, huh? Hmm. Black box, black box, black box. Hmm. Wait. Don't tell me. You're after the one Zeus hit on Earth? Possibly. If I were, where might it be? Phew. See? Found him. Yeah, I guess this counts. <laughs> Let me down! Hmm? Just a second. <laughs> you guys are here. Sora, Donald, Goofy. You literally dropped in. Gotta say, I'm impressed. <laughs> Thanks. Like the catch. Yeah. Thanks, Herc. But what's going on? <sighs> Take a guess. Starts with an H. Ah, I get the picture. Actually, we bumped into the H-ster on the way here. 
He said something about conquering the whole cosmos. All of it, huh? Nice of him to show a little self-restraint. Well, whatever he's planning, I'll send him running back across the sticks. <laughs> That's our Herc. So, Sora, is there a reason you guys are visiting? I'm guessing it's not just for the cheese and olives. Oh, yeah. It sounds like somebody forgot. Black Sora! I just took my time remembering. Herc, I came here so I could ask you something. Ask me? Yeah. Do you remember the last time we were together? You were feeling down and out. How'd you get your strength back? When you jumped in and saved Meg? Huh. That's tough. All I know is that she was in trouble. Suddenly, I wanted to save her with all my heart, but... It's not like I could tell you how. Oh, man. What's wrong? All my strength is gone from me, too. That's why I need you. Because I was hoping you might have a solution or something. I'm sorry, Sora. Let's talk later. Right. Once we've dealt with these guys. Hercules! <laughs> You're okay. Meg! Boy, that didn't look so fun. No, not with the Heartless involved. We're just lucky our friend showed up. Well, what do you know? Sora, Donald, Goofy. <laughs> Guess I owe you a big thank you. Meg, you need to stay someplace safe. We'll search the city and make sure everyone manages to get clear of the fire. Be careful, Wonder Boy. I will. So, you guys in? Of course we're in! We are heroes! Mm-hmm. Break a leg, then. Heroes. Mm. Phil, you should go with Meg. You gotta keep her safe. Hmm? I hear a voice! From which way? Over that way! Hmm? Help me! <gasps> oh no! There's a little girl caught in the fire! Let's go! Wait! Running's too slow! Uh, then what's the other choice? Hmm... Oh. Get on that. It's a child? Hope so. Like this? That's good. Now hold on tight. Whoa! Hurt! Maybe we should. I don't think this is a good idea! Oh! <laughs> Saving me. Yeah, no <laughs> prob. We better check and see if anyone else needs us. Mm -hmm. Well, 
if it isn't Sora and the King's Pawns. Huh? <gasps> Maleficent! Pete! Are you the reason the Heartless are here? Certainly not. Say, Maleficent, I don't know about his sidekicks, but Kid Keyblader here looks way punier than the last time we saw him. <laughs> I say we finish him off while we still can. Waste no time with the boy, he's inconsequential. We have a far more pressing matter to attend to. Hmm? Oh, we got to find that black box. Be silent, you fool! Mm -hmm. As for you three, we shall meet again, when I have time for such trifles. Yeah, and you'd better get your act together before then. Later, twerps! Wait! Ugh. Ugh. <sighs> it's fine. I can take it. Gorge, it sure don't sound like it. Did Pete saying mean things bother ya? It's fine. I can take it. You gotta get stronger! We know ya! You can take it! Don't say that! Oh, I just said what he said. I can take it! Ouch! Oh. Oh. Fellas, I just got a crazy idea. The shield. <laughs> Ready? Here goes. Oh. They got insurance. If there's anybody else stuck out here, we better find them fast. Thanks, kid. Someone help! Where did all these monsters come from? Hercules! Where are you? Uh, Black! Oh no! Help is on the way! We'll put these hotheads out! Hang on up there! Huh? Who are you three? Where is Hercules? I really was too! <laughs> Thank you, you're so kind. Keep training and one day you'll be great <laughs> heroes oh. just like Hercules. <laughs> Keep training? Is it that obvious? Just for you. Hey! Well, I think we all have a ways to go. But we'll get there together. Yeah, we will. Go. Oh! Oh! Herc! Sora! Huh? More Heartless! Ooh. You take them! We need to save these people! Hurt! Can you hold the building? No problem! Donald! Goofy! We gotta do this quick! 
my shield ready! Breathe! Get the people out! Okay! Are you guys alright? You need hurry, to get to safety! Hurry. Go! Quickly! It's nothing. That's what these are for. Oh, huh? Oh wow, very nice. Oh marks. No organization. You're Zigbar. Ah, uh, all this altruism is giving me the warm and fuzzies. So then, does having a heart of light come with an extremely good insurance policy? Just say what you mean. Oh, but I did though. No good will ever come from putting other people first. I was able to save Meg's life because I was ready to risk my own. Because you've got friends in high places, you mean. Tricks like that don't fly for your average Joe. What do you know? You weren't even there. If you were, you'd admire Herc's courage. I don't admire one guy leaping into danger if it means someone else might have to jump in to save him. You're all just lining up to lose out. Dooming others to take the fall with you. Oh. And you can spare me the usual party line. Yes, hearts are powerful when they're connected. But if you put too much of that power in one place, some of those hearts might end up breaking. Still, Sora, that doesn't mean you should change. Accept the power you're given. Find the hearts joined to yours. Why would I ever take advice from you? As if. You don't have any choice but to follow this sweet little trail of breadcrumbs. And at the end, you'll finally realize what destiny has in store for you. In fact, your reward might be right around the corner. You're so close! <laughs> Hearts breaking? Whose hearts? Sora, don't let him bother you. He's just trying to get under your skin because he thinks he can. But we'll prove him wrong. We'll show him that our sacrifices haven't been for nothing. You're right. Mm-hmm. Besides, we're already proof enough. We're a team. When we're together, we can do anything. Yeah. What reward?
Nice job, Wonder Boy. We checked the whole area. It looks like everyone's safe. That's great. We did what we could. You heroes have been busy little bees. <laughs> 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 Oh, look. More trouble. It's Hades. <clears throat> Herc, let's go! Right. We need to get to the top of the mountain and stop Hades! That's odd. The river's never this full. This sure does feel awfully familiar. Yeah, just like before. Guys, this is getting worse by the minute. I hope I'm wrong, but my family may need me. Sora, I'm gonna fly ahead. You've been a big help, but leave the rest to me. Family? Yeah. Dad's king of the gods. Yeah. What? what? His father is a god, but doesn't that mean Herc is a god too? Oh, I think it does. No wonder he's so strong. Then he'll be okay. Round he? No. Organization 13's here. He'll need our help. Good point. We gotta go. The heroes never quit. Huh. That's tough. All I know is that she was in trouble. Suddenly, I wanted to save her with all my heart. We fight with all our heart. Come on! Mm -hmm.
One down. They're not yeah. so tough by themselves. Mm. Okay, what's next? This Olympus? Gosh, it's amazing! Oh, whoa! Nope! Climb up, but what will we use for buttholes? I swear to you, Hades, when I get out of it. No, I'm the one giving orders now, Bolt Boy. Don't get too comfortable, Hades. Huh? Huh? We're gonna stop you! What?
Now it's all four of them. So what? There are four of us, too. Actually, I think I can make it five. No! <laughs> Thank you, my boy. Yeah! Whoa! 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 <laughs> now, watch your old man work. years into that plan and you probably ruined it! I really don't like you. Just give it up already. You'll never beat Herc, no matter how many times you try. Yeah, stay in the underworld where you belong. Tell him the time of your afterlife. Enough already! I did not come this far to be ridiculed by Zeusy High and Mighty, his little sunspot, and a trio of clowns! You know what? I'll just go ahead and destroy you! Hades! <sighs> the exit is that way. <sighs> Hold on. I almost forgot. <sighs> That one's for trying to wreck Thebes. You'll pay for this! I have a very, very long memory. I can uh, still dunk your little nutmeg in a river of death! Are you sure you want to leave all this behind? Isn't Olympus your home? I'm your family! I can see my family anytime I want. If I stayed, I'd have to be apart from the person I love most. And that life would be empty. <gasps> I finally know where I belong. Hercules. Mm. Sora, we never got back to your question. Can I help? Mm, it's okay. I think I'm meant to figure it out for myself. I'll find my strength the way you found yours. Something to fight for. With all my heart. Mm, I guess you did have the answer. Well, you've got heart, Sora. Just keep at it, and I know you'll be stronger than ever. Yeah, I might even end up stronger than you are. Gary goes again. <laughs> <laughs> Are you sure this box with the Book of Prophecies is for reals? Yeah, I think that dig batted black was pulling your leg. Be quiet and dig, you imbecile. I must find that Book of Prophecies and make it my own. His was the only clue we have. We cannot afford to dismiss it without a thorough investigation. I'm just saying a shot in the dark ain't gonna get us any closer to... Whoa! What is it? Have you found something? Show it to me at once, fool! Yes, yeah, sir, easy. This has got to be that Pandora's box Hades mentioned. Leave it. What? After all that digging? That is not the box which I desire. 
We are finished with this world. Come. No. May your heart What's wrong, Riku? Are you tired? Do you need a break? We can stop. No, just... I've been here. I should know this place. But that all seems like another life. Well, gee, uh, think of all you've seen. All the feelings you've felt. Why, you've done years of growing in almost no time at all. I remember my first time here. I was so scared. <sighs> but now my doubts and fears are gone. If anything, I feel exhilarated. And it's not because there's darkness in me. I know too well what that rush is like. This is different. And it's not adrenaline either. I know Aqua needs us, but I'm ready. I'm in control now. <laughs> Maybe it's because you're with me this time. Mm -mm. It's not me. I think it's because you finally found inside you that special strength to protect what matters. What? Sometimes you care so much for somebody that other feelings disappear. And then there's no room for fear or doubt. Is that it? Strength to protect what matters. It reminds me of a promise I made. To who? Just someone I once met. Can't tell. Sounds like a good memory. Yeah. While we're reminiscing, Mickey, does any of this look familiar? Uh, sort of. But the realm of darkness has changed since I was here with Aqua. Yeah, it's different from what I remember. Usually, I'd just follow my heart, and Aqua would show me the way. But the closer I get, the hazier our connection feels. You mean... Maybe, but we can't give up hope. Yeah. This beach. It's gone. Huh? I'm positive Aqua was here. But now, her trail's gone dim. I've been here too. With Sora. Really? This is where we found our way back to the Realm of Light. Hey, maybe Aqua did too. Aqua... has fallen into an even darker abyss. Somewhere I can't see her. And I don't think we're equipped to dive any deeper than we already are. So then... Be careful. Even the least threatening Heartless are stronger in this realm. I got it.
It's not over. Be careful. <gasps> oh no! What? Because somebody needs me. Who are you? Riku? Wake up! Riku! <gasps> Are you okay? Uh. Where'd the Heartless go? I got more than half of them. And the rest vanished. But uh, they spit you out first. Ugh, thanks. I owe you. I know you feel invincible, but we're not. Are you all right, Mickey? Yeah, thanks to the new gear. But your Keyblade... Oh. <laughs> hmm. The Heartless here are stronger than what we expected. I guess we probably should have powered up our Keyblades before we came in here, huh? I think we need to go back to Master Yen's Hit's tower so we can regroup. But Aqua's... still down here alone, facing enemies like that. I know. What if she's feeling as scared and alone as I felt the first time I came here? How long are we supposed to keep her waiting in this awful place? But Aqua... She's like Sora! What? No, 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 no! Strong like Sora! Oh. <sighs> okay. Good. Then I guess she's gonna be alright. Sora could fall into any darkness and swim his way out. Besides, we won't be long. Right. Huh? Can't use this Keyblade anymore. Might as well leave it here. For the other me. What? I see. You could not regain your strength. Ah, uh, no biggie. I still learned a lot. Regardless, Sora, you will need the power of waking. Oh. Uh, uh... It can't be gone forever. Maybe something will trigger it real soon. Like what exactly? Hello. How about a bite on the head? Hey. Perhaps it could be something that is as simple as that. Wait, you think so too? Whenever you are in need, magic happens. That is your greatest strength, Sora. You make it sound like an accident. <laughs> Whoa! Huh? We're back, Master! Whoa! Oh, oh, wow! You guys are all here! We were here before, but you didn't wait! Oh, 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 hey there, fellas! 
So, what have you three been up to? We were visiting... Oh! And to figure out how to get all of Sora's lost powers back. What? It was a big disappointment. Oh, what a shame. But, honestly... We didn't fare any better. Did you manage to figure out where Aqua is? Cause Master Yen Sid said that's why you fellas left. Over the hunt? Come on! Can I finally say something? We know Master Aqua made it as far as the beach that Sora and I once visited. But that's where her trail ends. Meaning? All traces of her vanish into the Great Abyss, beneath the Realm of Darkness. She's dead! No. Sora was dragged into the Abyss during his exam, and I went in after him. So I think if we find someone who is really close to Aqua, and they make the dive, they could reach her down there. I'm not sure who's even left to ask. Ventus is hidden, and Aqua's the only one who knows where. Plus, nobody's seen Terra in ages. Aqua was the last. So Aqua, she's gonna be the key to finding all three. Yes, their teacher, Master Ericus, would have been another possibility. Had Xehanort not mercilessly struck him down. I'll save her. <coughs> huh? <coughs> but Sora, that's gonna be super hard since you don't have the power of waking. Huh? Sorry. I have no idea why that just popped out. Well, it was pretty convincing. Yeah. Better not let us down. Mm. Sora, you must focus on regaining your lost power of waking. Mickey and Riku, I recall that Master Aqua journeyed to many worlds and connected with others who could be the link we need. Good plan, sir. Riku and I will retrace her steps and see if we can find any sort of clues. But first... Hmm? We got hit pretty hard in the Realm of Darkness. My Keyblade was damaged, and the Heartless broke Riku's clean in half. So, we're gonna need to get replacements before we can continue. In that case, rendezvous with Kairi and Lee. They are continuing their training under the tutelage of the wizard Merlin. Yes, sir. Also, I would like you to deliver these for me. Are they? Yes, they are the same as the ones I gave you. Special vestments to shield Kyrie and Lee from the darkness. We got them! What? No fair! What about my outfit, Master? Sora, don't bother me like that. I can't consider it. Settle down. I have new clothes for you too, Sora. Yeah? A gift from <laughs> the good fairies. Huh? I knew you'd come through for me. Thanks. Those are no ordinary garments, Sora. Like before, they have very special powers. So it took extra time to prepare them. In addition, there is a gift <laughs> from Chip and Dale inside. Cool. Okay. <laughs> Happy now? Yep. Now you are all ready to proceed. Hey, wait! Don't forget about me! Jiminy! Every journey worth going on needs a cricket to keep track of it. And I can't let you start this one without old Jiminy Cricket by your side. The whole team's back! Yeah! <laughs> Good. Now to mark the beginning of a new journey. I wish for you to have this, Sora. Huh? 
Okay. That is a heart binder. Think of it as a good luck charm made just for you. You have a gift, Sora, for connecting with others. And this makes that gift stronger. It's time to go! May your heart be your guiding key. See? Hmm. Mm hmm. Okay, we'll go. Um. Oh, come on, when you get serious. Give me a break, okay? I told you. These things take time. Gorge, is it just me? Or is this turning into a routine? Huh? Uh... What? It's coming from you, Sora. Huh? Uh... Uh... What's this? Not me, magic scrap. But I don't know how. Maybe this. Hooray! He picked up! Huh? Dale? Hey, Chipper! I finally got him! Hurry up, Chip! Well, it's about time! Chip? You gotta answer the phone, Sora! Or we can't give you updates! We got lots and lots of important stuff we want to tell you! That's why we asked Master Yen Sid to make sure you got this gummy phone we made ya! so we'd be able to stay in touch with you at all times. And it takes pictures. Oh, you finally finished it. Say, with this gummy phone, we can talk to each other across worlds. In fact, I might even try writing my journal on it. Wow, sounds like it's pretty handy, guys. So, what's so important? This, back when you and Riku quested through the sleeping worlds, Riku recovered some secret research data that Ansem the Wise hid inside you! Ansem's code! Uh-huh. We've been working our tails off trying to crack it and see what it says. The data has been encrypted, so we've only deciphered some of it. Huh? Oh. I guess we haven't spoken since the castle. I'm Ienzo. Alias is here too. Alias, whatever's between you and Roxas, it's in the past. <sighs> Zora, the reason we're here is because you and your friends defeated our nobodies, thereby recompleting us. We cast off our hearts by choice, make no mistake, but we didn't know that Xemnas, or rather, Xehanort, was deceiving us. Huh? Xemnas? Oh, he's with them! Not anymore. Xemnas and Xehanort have no hold over us now. We're just students of the heart. Exactly the same as we were before all of this began. Yeah, right. Hmm. But you know, now that I think about it, Axel's on our side now. friends we want to bring back to this world just the same as you. To do that, we have to work together. In that spirit, Sora, we found some intriguing data in the bit of code we deciphered. Is it about me? Yes. In order to piece your memories back together, our teacher Ansem the Wise took a close look at your heart. And what he found is that your heart doesn't belong just to you. It doesn't? Gorge, you don't seem surprised. Yeah. Honestly, I suspected as much. There's another heart inside mine. I think it's Roxas's. Just like Naminé is still inside Kyrie's. Interesting. Well, no one knows your heart better than you. To be honest, we still have a plethora of questions on our side. 
But the idea has merit. It's incredible enough that you and your nobody are able to coexist. If you share a heart, no wonder someone as remarkable as you caught Ansem the Wise's eye. We'll keep investigating based on your hypothesis. I'll be in touch. Okie dokie! We'll give you fellows a ring if there's anything else! Remember, me and Chip, the guys at Radiant Garden, and King Nicky and everybody are never far away! And Jiminy, would you do us a favor? Teach Sora how to use the dummy phone? Leave it to me! I have to find Roxas and save him. The others are following Aqua's heart. So I'll follow Roxas's heart. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Trust the guidance that your heart gives you, Sora. That's what Master Yen Sid said. Well, go! <laughs> oh, that's easy. Gorge, we forgot to fill Master Yen Sid in on what happened. Should we go back? Hmm. You mean about Maleficent and Zigbar? No, the others have already got enough on their plates as it is. Why go stressing them out? The three of us know how to handle a couple of old adversaries, right? Yeah, I guess. But doesn't that thing Pete said bother you? The black box? Come on, we're talking about Pete. That means it's probably no big deal. Oh, I don't know. Oh, cool! The trams are still here! So, uh, it hasn't been that bad. Feels like it. Maybe you're feeling what Roxas feels because he misses home. Mm-hmm. Actually, I ran into Roxas in the Sleeping Worlds. It was like seeing into his heart for the first time. And he was in the data scan, too. Uh-huh. It was a test to see if your data version was ready to face the hurt that you carry inside. Was I ready? I do know hurt. When I lost Riku and Kairi, and later when I lost the Keyblade, and you guys had to go on without me like that? Having no one to turn to was the worst kind of hurt. But that just shows how much you mean to me. Carrying around a little hurt can't be all that bad. Hurting is part of caring. Of course. Any Sora is still Sora. So wait. If Roxas feels something, then we're in the right place. Roxas, I'm gonna find you. Huh? What is that? Nobody! <gasps> Yeah! 
What was that voice? I know I heard it. I didn't hear it. You sure it wasn't the wind? Or something else? I'm pretty sure. Where'd they come from? Huh? Get the ice cream later. Huh? <laughs> what? Hold up. See? Voices. New ones? <laughs> What? Hainer? Pence! Olette! <laughs> oh, what is that? <laughs> hey! Sora! Hello, goodbye! Uh, oh. Go! We got this! Nice fighting. Thanks, Sora. Hainer, Pence, Olette, it's been ages. What? It hasn't been that long. Yes, he. Donald, Goofy, how are ya? We're good. Howdy there, Olette. So does this mean that weird stuff's going down again? You kidding, uh. Pence? When have we ever seen a tornado of shadowy blobs before? It's not weird. This is underprecedented. Hmm, I guess it is. The creatures from the last time were bright white. These things must be new. Man, I can't wait to get to sleuthing. We are already done with the school project, silly. Whatever's going on, you wouldn't be here unless you had a good reason. Which is? Well, actually, we're looking for Roxas. Roxas? That's funny. I don't know any Roxas, mm. but the name sounds familiar. Maybe we bumped into him somewhere. Uh, that's one way to put it. Actually, he might have been friends with another version of you. Hmm? This photograph. Yeah, we've got the same one. Oh, yeah, the other Twilight Town. It's like one of those Spot the Differences puzzles, except really easy. I guess in that town, we're friends with this Roxas person. Sora, let us help you track Roxas down. <laughs> really? Sure, he seems like a pretty cool guy. <laughs> yeah, he is. Great, then let's all go ask around town. If alternate us knew Roxas, then maybe alternate other folks did too. Mm -hmm. Sora, you three should go to the place in the photo. It's the old mansion. The three of us will cover places in town. Thanks. Oh yeah, I got this phone thingy that takes pictures. <laughs> Wanna snap a photo while we're all here? Sure, that's a great idea. <laughs> yeah. Hmm? Wait, who's taking it? Oh. Hmm. Mm. Uh, why do I have to do it? 
Hey, tough luck. You drew the short straw. It's okay. Oh, I'm sitting out of the photo with you, Donald. Can you take the photograph? <laughs> Everybody smile! <laughs> wow! That came out great! Oh, a lucky emblem! Lucky emblem? Oh yeah, they are huge right now. Supposedly, these things are hidden all over town. And if you get a picture of them, they'll bring you good luck. Cool! <laughs> Wait, look guys, is that... <laughs> You're right! I see it too! <laughs> I knew it! Good luck, because they're not all this easy to find. Okay, we better start asking around. You start by checking out the old mansion. We'll catch up. Got it. Huh? Hmm? What's that? Oh. Heartless! What do you think they're up to? Hmm. Look! On that branch! The Heartless have him surrounded! Oh no! What's up? Yeah! Well, take care. Whoa! What? What is? Whoa! 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 whoa. Lucky! That little feller's parked on your head. Huh? Would you cut that up? Uh, oh! Huh? You know, maybe he wants you to pick up the fruit for him. Mm, okay, that's fine, but I can do it by myself. I just need to collect the fruit? Right then. So, what are you going to do with all this anyway? Huh? Hmm? Uh -huh. Oh. Well, okay. You be careful going home. See you around! Next stop, the mansion! I see it! That building up ahead!
What do you think, guys? This place is even creepier than I remember. Well, they do say that this mansion is haunted. <sighs> hey there! Huh? Ah! 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 Thanks for the heart attack! Oh, what? Did I scare you? Uh, oh. What about kids? Our bad. So how did it go? Did you get any leads? <laughs> nope. Afraid not. The asking around thing was a total bust. Yep. This old mansion is our last hope. You guys ready? Another Twilight Town awaits. Yeah. Here we go. Eh, the password was uh sea salt ice cream, right? Okay, I'm in. Let's get that transporter working. Uh, uh. Oh man, the transporter's been protected. Protected from what? I guess from us? We can't use it to get to the other Twilight Town. Why not? It worked before. We sent Sora there. Well, that was then. And this is now. And there's no other way? None that I know. Great. Uh, huh? Hello, Sora. You wouldn't happen to be in front of a computer. Huh? Well, yeah. But how do you know that? I was tinkering with Ansem's computer. You know, to decrypt the code that was left in it. And I noticed that someone had logged in from another terminal. I figured it might be you. Uh, oh, yeah, the log terminal. You don't know any slug. Uh, oh, and what, you do? <laughs> I know I haven't got a clue. <laughs> then, uh... Who was it that logged in? Oh, hi there. This is Pence. I'm the one who logged into the computer. Good. As long as it's a user that we know we can trust. Yup. But I'm kind of stuck here. Hmm. One of the programs is protected, so... I can't uh... run it. Which program? Uh... The transporter to the other Twilight Town! Uh... It's the only way to find Roxas. You gotta help us. Another Twilight Town? And a transporter? Okay. A virtual town inside the computer made of data. A datascape? Fellas! Mm-hmm. We've seen one. That's what we used once to investigate Jiminy's journal. Maybe I can do something. Pence, let's get a network set up. My address here is... Okay, sharing is enabled. <gasps> huh? Were you able to fix it? Now that our two computers have been successfully networked together, I can take control of the terminal there and change the privileges. And Roxas? Yes. For the virtual world to be completely realized, Ansem the Wise would have included Roxas' full data in the construction. Meaning, somewhere on your machine there's a log of that data that... Uh, basically, we can decipher Ansem's code more quickly, and we can analyze the virtual Twilight Town while we're at it. Okay, great. I can't computer, so do that. Glad you're following along. Don't worry, we'll handle it. Chip and Dale will be helping me out here on this end. I'll call you back as soon as we know anything more. Thanks. Oh, before I forget, a bit of troubling news. 
It's about one of the organization's former members. You knew him as Vexen. But to us, he was Ansem's apprentice, Evan. He was recompleted like the rest of us. But hadn't regained consciousness yet. Then, sometime after Lee left, Evan vanished. Alias and Dylan, the two you knew as Lexius and Zaldin, they went out looking for him, but he's just gone. And I'm starting to worry. Oh? You think he's on their side? I think it's a real possibility. He's a devious researcher. You should be careful. All right. Thanks. Oh no! We got work! I totally forgot! Really? But what about all this? Hey, both are important. We're gonna need some cash to go to the beach. Also, don't forget the pretzels. Gotta buy four now. Hmm? Uh... Oh, I get it. He's thinking ahead. <laughs> Later, Sora. Yeah, see ya, Hainer. Bye, Donald. Goofy. Goodbye! Oh, and since I'm manning the computer here, you guys are in charge of earning my share. No pretzel for pence. <laughs> hey! <sighs> so, what's next? Want to go back to town? So, you think you can bring Roxas back? Oh. Hey. Ansem! Semnus! Roxas should never have existed in the first place. What you seek is impossible. Roxas does exist. His heart's inside my heart. And in the unlikely event you did manage to separate the two, where is it you think you can put his heart? Well, Roxas used to live in the other Twilight Town, right? So, I'm just gonna put him back there. Do you even realize what you are saying? The other Twilight Town is just Data. A heart can live anywhere, even inside Data. There are hearts all around us. Hmm. Huh? Ansem and Zemnis used to be part of the same person, right? But look, now they exist separately just fine. Mm. If they can do it, then I don't see any reason why you and Roxas can't find a way. Oh, yeah! Yeah, you tell them, Captain Goofy! <laughs> In that case, by all means. Nothing would please us more than Roxas's return, of course. You wish? He'll never answer to you again! Still so blind, a nobody is what's left behind. When one gives his heart to darkness, there is only one way to bring Roxas back, which is for you to give your heart up as well. Sora, have you finally decided to call upon the darkness? <gasps> what? Go on then. The shadows are never out of reach. <sighs> Not darkness. Not if it helps him. We got this.
Mm-hmm. Herc said... He said, with all my heart. Okay, then all my heart it is. I'm getting Roxas out. Are you with me? Donald? Goofy? <laughs> you betcha! You. I don't know what Ansem and Xemnas want, but I think we better tell the others to watch out. Okay then, let's head back to town. Hmm. Get quiet, Jack. Subway's head up under that. Well, bless Whoa. my bagpipes. It was you laddies who rescued mm -hmm. my chef. It's like a strange. Huh? Wait. Didn't he sell ice cream in Hollow Bastion? That's right. But Uncle Scrooge here is what you might call a world traveler. Cool. <laughs> How are you, Uncle Scrooge? Oh, hello, Sora. You're looking hale and hearty. I heard you were on another grand adventure with these two. I hope Donald isn't making a menace of himself. Uh, why did you have to say that? So, Uncle Scrooge, what's that you were saying about a chef? Oh, right, right. The chef of me bistro here wanted to show you his appreciation. So, he baked this for ya! Hmm... What is it? Wow! wow cake! Hmm? Huh? The whole cake? It's for us? Huh? I mean, uh, settle down. Uh, the chef wants you to know it's not a cake, but a tart of fruit. He does? Why keep it under my hat? May I introduce... Little Chef. Oh, oh, it's you! Uncle Scrooge, you opened the bistro and tried on town! Aye! It all started a little while ago, when I was enjoying one of the best meals of my life. And when I asked to speak to the chef, I met this wee genius. As it turns out, he wanted to expand his culinary horizons. So, I thought, that's an opportunity. And I finance the whole operation. Ooh, I think he wants to cook some more for you. Fetch some ingredients, especially anything unusual. That'll be fun, kind of like a scavenger hunt. And the more the better. The mark of a truly great chef is creating masterpieces out of anything. You can start right here in town. We'll do anything to try more of Little Chef's food. Yeah. That tart sure did look scrumptiously delicious. Okay, the ingredient hunt is on. Hey, guys! Huh? Oh. Painter, Olette. Uh, hey, boss. Uh, Done with the posters. Uh -huh. Hi! Good work, kids. You guys work for Uncle Scrooge here at the Bistro? Um, do we? He gave us a short job putting up these special posters. Mr. McDuck's hosting an open-air film festival in the courtyard. Cool, huh? <laughs> oh, Sora. Hold your phone up to the poster. Okay. There! You've just downloaded a promo game for the film. You can try it later. You did all this, Uncle Scrooge? Of course, laddie! Provide a bit of entertainment, and then give folks a nice, cozy place to relax. Like my bistro here. They'll all be happy and hungry, and eager to spend their money. <laughs> <laughs> Uncle Scrooge! Gore, she sure is canny. I always wondered how he keeps customers coming into his businesses over and over. 
Oh yeah, I'm no business guy, but I sure wouldn't want to be one of Uncle Scrooge's competitors. Seriously? <laughs> Whoa! Oh, right! I need to warn you guys. Why? Well, those creepy crawly things might come back for more. So stay on your toes. Sure. But don't we have you guys to take care of him for us? You have to leave again? Mm-hmm. It's our job! But we'll definitely be back. When are you gonna slow down? Sorry. Just do me a favor. Well, what is it? Don't make it too tough. I know how Roxas feels to be lost. But Donald and Goofy, Kyrie, brought me back by wishing with all their hearts. So, I was hoping the three of you would do the same and wish for Roxas. What? That's it? <laughs> That's no favor. We'll all wish. I'm wishing. Yeah. Me and Pence, too. <laughs> Thanks. Aren't you making it a little too obvious? We were instructed to guide him. Yes, just look at them. They wouldn't get far if we did not spell it out. Huh. Fair enough. But let's not forget how many times Sora still managed to rain on our parade. If he wavers from the path we lay, we destroy him. But in that case... We'll have to find ourselves another vessel. That is why we never have just one iron in the fire. I'm sorry I left without saying goodbye. Did Master Yen Sid tell you? I'm training to become a Keyblade wielder like you. That's right. No more waiting for you to come back from your adventures. I want to get out there and do my part to help. Merlin has used his magic to bring us to a place where time doesn't matter. We can take as long as we need to complete our training. He's an amazing wizard. Oh, and by us, I mean me and Lee. He's really sorry for all the trouble he caused. I told him it's fine, but he won't stop apologizing. I'll admit I was a little scared of him at first, but I've gotten to know him better. All he ever wanted was to help his friend. Honestly, it's hard not to like him. Every now and then, I catch him staring at me. When I ask what's wrong, he says, I'm not sure. I think I'm forgetting something. Don't know what. Sora, I think it may have something to do with you. Your journey is all about helping people. Some that you've never met before, and some like Lee that you have. They're all counting on you. It won't be easy, but I hope you'll remain the happy and cheerful Sora I know. There's no heart your smile can't reach. What's wrong? Huh? Uh, nothing. Sorry. Lee. What? I am. <laughs> A letter? Yep. To Sora? Mm, technically, yes. But I won't send it. It's more for me. Ask Merlin. He'll deliver it for you. Yeah, but it's okay. I just like talking to Sora, even if it's on paper. Huh, okay. Oh. Hmm? 
Here. Ice cream? Really? Yeah, I asked Merlin to pick these up. You know, we did both summon Keyblades. Gotta celebrate. You're sweet, Lee. <laughs> nah. What? No, uh, nothing. I just... You're trying to remember what you forgot? Well, I, uh... Yeah. Yeah. So tomorrow, you and me in the ring. You ready? Of course. Don't hold back, Lee. Promise? <sighs> Are you okay? Lee? Well, uh, yeah. Sorry. You're crying. What's wrong? Uh, something in my eyes. Lee. I'm gonna go. Sorry. Okay, but stop apologizing. Fine. On one condition. What? Call me Axel from now on. Got it? Memorized? Yeah. Okay, Axel. So this is the place where Aqua fell into the realm of darkness after she dove in to save Terra. Yeah, she said he was acting strange. Strange how exactly? She sensed darkness in him, and they ended up getting into a big fight. Right, and in the aftermath, the two of them disappeared. Around the same time, the guards found a stranger with white hair lying unconscious here in the square. A man calling himself Xehanort. Anson the Wise took the stranger in, but that was a mistake. Xehanort betrayed his master, stole his research, and along with his fellow apprentices, separated his heart from his body. Xehanort's heart took his master's name, Ansem, and traveled to the past to give his younger self instructions. He even briefly had control of you! His empty body stayed in the present, took the name Xemnas, and founded Organization 13. Their goal was to prepare 13 vessels for Xehanort's heart. Until we put an end to the organization. But all the while, young Xehanort had been visiting the future to choose 13 vessels of his own. Hearts with strong enough ties to him to begin a new organization. The real Organization 13. And now they're looking for a fight with us. But what happened to Terra? I thought you said that Aqua saved him. Yep, she did. The problem is we didn't notice. You remember the end of the Mark of Mastery exam? When Master Xehanort made his grand return? That's the Xehanort I remember. He was already a pretty old man then. But how do you explain Ansem and Xemnas, his heartless, and his nobody? Isn't it strange how young they look? Why aren't they old men? It's because Xehanort was using a different body when the split happened. That face from the portrait I mentioned? It wasn't just some stranger that Ansem the Wise took under his wing. It was the young man whose body Master Xehanort possessed. No way! 
That was Terra? Master Xehanort was using Terra? Yep. Master Xehanort told us another on our list belonged to him. He was talking about Terra. Turns out, Aqua saved more than just her friend that day. Okay. But Master Xehanort is an old man again now. Where did Terra's body go? Hmm. <gasps> it's because Master Xehanort's collecting vessels. He claimed to have two of our seven lights. We got Sora back, but Terra must still be on Xehanort's side. He's with Organization 13? We should warn Sora. Yep, and Merlin too. Yeah. <laughs>